Reducing Chemical Intolerance – 7 Steps to Creating a Clean Air Oasis We spend more than 90% of our time indoors, and often the air that we breathe indoors is more polluted than the outside. Individuals with chemical intolerance may experience an array of symptoms following exposure to toxicants commonly found inside the home from smoke, cleaning products, fragranced products, and other chemicals. The symptoms of chemical intolerance are varied but include headaches, mood changes, fatigue, brain fog, and stomach difficulties. Researchers at UT Health San Antonio, USA have demonstrated that improving indoor air quality reduces the symptoms of chemical intolerance. One of their most important recommendations is to create a clean air oasis in your home to ensure the air that you breathe is as free as possible from smoke, chemicals, fragrances, and other common indoor pollutants. The researchers propose seven key steps to creating a clean air oasis in your home. Step one, pick a room. This should be the room in which you spend most of your time. For many people, this is the bedroom. While you should bring in clean air wherever possible, e.g. by opening windows, you should avoid doing this when pollen, humidity, or pollution levels are high. Step two, eliminate indoor air pollutants. You should remove all products that have strong odors, including cleaning and laundry products, pesticides, perfume, cologne, scented lotions, deodorants, cosmetics, candles, and air fresheners, even plug-ins and diffusers. You should also avoid aerosol sprays such as hairspray, as their tiny droplets are easily inhaled. Step three, do not permit pets inside the oasis. Our pets can trigger asthma, allergies, and other problems, so should not be allowed inside the clean air oasis. Step four, clean safely. You should only use fragrance-free products for cleaning and doing laundry. It's best to do cleaning and vacuuming when sensitive individuals are not in the immediate area. You should also remember to ventilate during and after cleaning. Step five, avoid burning anything indoors. Smoke and combustion gases can irritate the lungs, so you should not permit smoking, vaping, or burning candles or incense. You should also avoid the use of fireplaces, open flame gas heaters, and unvented water heaters. To prevent carbon monoxide poisoning, you should never heat your home using a gas stove, gas oven, or hibachi. Electric stoves and electric heaters, when used properly, are a better health option. Step six, go the extra mile. An air purifier with high-efficiency particulate air and charcoal filters can remove some pollutants. You should keep the purifier running while the room is occupied, even overnight, and remember to bring in clean outside air whenever possible. In addition, check and change or clean filters as needed or recommended. Step 7. Learn more. Finally, many of our choices affect the quality of air that we breathe, so it's useful to learn how to remove fragrances from fabrics, stop pests without using pesticides, control humidity and mold, and find safer products for home repair or remodeling. You can find further guidance on this at tiltresearch.org. For more information, contact Dr. Raymond Palmer at palmer.r at uthscsa.edu.